Well, who's protecting folks at the Springdale Shopping Center on Airport? The center is without security tonight. Local 15 News has confirmed the owners of the property canceled its contract with a security firm during this peak holiday shopping season. Local 15's Madupe Idowu joins us live with more. Madupe. Well, Kim, you know, not too many shoppers I spoke to today were happy of obviously with the lack of security that's here as well with some store managers who I spoke to off camera who say they are concerned for their safety and their employees and customers as well. That's great. If you take a look at the Springdale Outdoor Shopping Center, you'll see no security. Why this time of year? This is the worst time to turn around and change security for anyone coming out. With Thanksgiving a few days away and Christmas arriving in about a month, many like Carl Hertz who come to shop at the center on Airport Boulevard feel a little uneasy. This is a bad time of the year from November through January. You know, uh, there's a lot of people that want things that, doesn't, that do not have the money to get them and so they take them. Officials tell us Springdale has, quote, demauled and is now an outdoor shopping center, which has less security risk than a mall like Bel Air. According to Bricksmore Properties, it terminated its contract with the security firm because, quote, our security firm did not want to discuss options to appropriately scale our security services to the new center type, so we parted ways. It's not very safe out here anymore the way things are. Well, I think they should keep it at least through the holidays. The security firm once took care of patrolling the parking lot of the busy strip, especially during extended holiday hours. If I want to shop for my husband, I got to have him here because that's the only way I feel safe. Coming to do shopping for, I mean, it just doesn't make sense. Reps tell us they haven't had any trouble so far and they are okay with their decision. Now, company reps tell us they are currently interviewing for smaller security firms to take over the job on a much smaller scale. For now, reporting live in Mobile, I'm Adupe Edo, Local 15 News.